Here we're asked to graph g of x equals the quantity x minus two squared plus one. To do that, we'll use the transformations. We begin with the basic graph. g of x here will have the same basic shape as y equals x squared, the squaring function. And we know when we subtract two units inside the function, that produces a translation, a horizontal translation to the right, two units. And adding one outside the function like this produces a vertical translation up one unit. Once we identify the translations, we can then begin to graph. Let's start with the graph of y equals x squared. And here we have it. Now let's follow these points as we shift them right two units and up one. And here you can see the vertex shifted over two units and up one. The vertex for the final graph will be two comma one. And as we shift these other points, uh, you can get more points on the graph to get a more accurate final result. Now let's connect the dots and write our final graph. And there you have it, the basic squaring function shifted to the right two units and up one.